This is it right here. You ready guys? Here we go. Hmm. <laughs> Every day I'm chuffling. Hey guys, it's June. Welcome back to my channel. And before I get started, let me give you all a big old hug and tell each and every one of you how much I love and adore you, appreciate you, etc., etc. I mean that. I really do. Anyway, you guys, today's video is about making truffles. But before I get started, let me explain this get up. It is no makeup Monday. That's right. That's what I'm doing. On Mondays, there's like no makeup going on. The hair is up. I don't care. I need to be free, free of the makeup. So before you come to me and say, what is going on with her? Let me just put it out there. And also, yeah, I'm wearing my, uh, my Chipotle get up. That's not what this video is about. It's about making chaffles. And if you guys don't know what chaffles are, I am brand new to this too. It's my new addiction. This is my new friend. This is the Dash Mini Waffle Maker. And this is what you make chaffles with. Now, if you guys are on that, you know, low carb, low carb lifestyle, this is perfect because I am going to make a basic chaffle recipe just using egg and cheese, and that's it. It's all protein, yes. And the possibilities are endless, really. You can make pizza chaffles, you can make chocolate chaffles, pumpkin cheesecake chaffles. You can just make this as a bread, takes place of your bread, to make sandwiches, anything, cold cuts. Um, chicken salad, anything, chicken parm. I mean, the possibilities are endless here. This is a game changer for me. I am so excited. This weekend I made McDonald's McGriddles, or should I go McDonald's McGriddles <laughs> for Dennis and he absolutely loved it. I made stuffed French toast for myself. <sighs> It's just crazy. So before I get started, I wanted to let you know that I am doing a giveaway of the Dash Waffle Mini Waffle Iron, and this video is not sponsored, so this is me buying it for a lucky winner. All you have to do is comment down below, like this video, share it if you want. You don't have to share it, but comment and like this video, and you will be automatically entered into winning a Dash Mini Waffle Iron. Yeah, I will be announcing the winner on January 19th. Yes, I will. I'll be announcing the winner. So, without further ado, let's get started. Stay to the end so you can see what sandwich I made and then you'll see what I think about it as I crunch into my chaffle sandwich. Okay, you guys, stay right there. Okay, so this is for your basic chaffle. This is all you need. This is really all you need. One scrambled egg, a little bit of cheese. You probably won't even need this much cheese. And you need your Dash Mini Waffle Maker. Now the cheese that I am using is just any old shredded cheese. You can use mozzarella cheese, cheddar cheese, provolone, anything you want. Now, what's good about this is when you're using cheese, you really don't need to use a spray for this. All you need to do, guys, is take a sprinkle of this. Make sure your iron is nice and hot. Just sprinkle a little bit around. That's it. I mean, really, just a tiny bit. Let it sit there for like a few seconds. Now you can take a little scooper and we're going to put the egg on here. Now you don't want to overload it. You just want to get it to where it covers it somewhat, just like that. Now each egg makes about three chaffles. So it's amazing. Like you get so much from this one egg. And now let that sit for a few seconds and then we're going to put the cheese on top. Now, the cheese is used, I'm getting it all over. The cheese is used to make the chaffle crispy. 
and so that it's not just so eggy and it gives it a little bit of, you know, the salty flavor. So we're gonna let that cook for six minutes. I find that six minutes makes the perfect chaffle. So I'll be back in six minutes. Okay, so six minutes has passed. <sighs> Look at that, you guys. And here, how crunchy it is. Amazing. Let's look at the other side. Look at that. It's hot. So I'm picking it out with my nails and I'm going to transfer it over to a plate and I'm going to make a few more out of that one egg and I'll be right back. last one look at this what so look at this guys come on come on three chuffles one egg crispy delicious now i am going to make a turkey sandwich and i am going to show you what it looks like and how it tastes here is my turkey look at me my turkey chaffle sandwich. Look at this, you guys. And now people would say, well, how do you eat this? Don't you have the surgery? Yes, but think about this. This is only two thirds of an egg, two slices of turkey. What am I eating? I know it looks a lot, but it really isn't. And I'm getting such good protein. So I have a little bit of mayo on here. You could put mustard, you could do anything. Possibilities are endless. Now, for the crunch test, the delicious test. Are we ready? Here we go. Oh, let's get a good spot. Are you like one of those people like me? Are you like, you're like me? You gotta look for that good spot. Oh, I think this is it. No, wait, this is it right here. You ready guys? Here we go. Hmm. <laughs> What? Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. This takes a place of bread. Game changer. I'm thinking of all the possibilities. <laughs> take it with you. Take two of them. If you're going out to eat, take it with you. If you're eating something with a bun, I use it as a bun. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as I enjoyed making it and I really do. I'm very passionate about this. This is like my new addiction. Um, if you want to see me do any more recipes, comment down below. Let me know what you'd like me to make and I will make it and I will give you the shout out for giving me the idea and I am excited. And um, I hope you guys go get your chaff along. Get your chaff along. Get your, get your chaff along. Hey guys, don't forget to go to the link down below and um, yeah, what are your chaff along? $10, it's like nothing. It's gonna be a game changer for you. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.